Hello and welcome to highlights of the 7th edition of the Amstel Gold Classic Round 6 of the Women's World Tour for 2021. A circuit around Valkenburg, 118 kilometres, taking in seven laps of a 16.9 kilometre circuit. The Kalumaberg, the Velberberg and the famous Kauberg with the climbs along the route leading up to the finish. A fast race expected from the gun. The early stages of the Amsterdam goal was like throwing a match into a box of fireworks as they came in to the final laps. It really had been a gradual whittling down process to the select group. Unfortunately, a world champion Anna van der Breggen in the rainbow jersey, not making it through to the front group after recent sickness. Lucinda Brand um, launching multiple moves off the front for Trek Segafredo. The world cyclocross champion really has found her road legs. She went clear with Ashley Norman Passio and Grace Brown, but it was the teammate Katrina Allerud of Annemiek van Vloot that brought things back under control inside the final 30 kilometers in the final couple of laps. Grace Brown of Team Bike Exchange going clear with Paulina Royakas of the Live Racing team. Grace Brown, the winner of the OxyClean Classic earlier on in the season. The two riders had built a gap of 20 seconds. Erica Magnaudi of Ceratis at WNT was giving chase, but it was a descent that put paid to the day in the breakaway for Paulina Royak as this left Grace Brown alone in front. But the Aussie, we know what a time trialing specialist she is in this sort of situation. Magnaudi made it up to Royakas, but they were swept up by the group behind that contained the likes of Mariana Voss. Same yellow and black of Jumbo Visma, Annemiek Van Vloot and Cecily Utrup Ludwig. World Tour leader Elisa Longoborghini as long with teammates of Grace Brown. Out of the bottom corner onto the Kauberg for the final time. And it was a trademark move by Annemiek Van Vluten. But 2019 winner Cassia Nuviadoma of Canyon Shram ground her way across the gap with Mariana Voss right on the wheel. Nuvia Doma would make it clear it would be Elisa Longoborghini of Trek Segafredo wearing the World Tour leader's jersey that got up to her inside the final couple of kilometres. They were looking for the Flam Rouge and a game of cat and mouse played out at the top. In 2012, the Valkenburger Worlds, it had been Mariana Voss that took it from Rachel Needham with Longoborghini in the bronze medal. Ash Mulman Passio of SD Works with fast finishing Deming Vollering in the group brought it back under control, but Voss was poised and ready. Longa Borghini was the first rider to launch the sprint. Van Vluten went down the centre. Mariana Voss, who had looked incredible throughout the day, would come to the line with a fast finishing Demi Vollering throwing her bike at the line to take second place. Following had missed out on Brabant Appeal in a similar manner. Mariana Vos, though, on this occasion, not celebrating too early. The Amstel Gold belongs to the greatest of all time. Great replay of the sprint. Mariana Voss makes a move, but watch out for that purple jersey of Demi Vollering. Voss sits up and celebrates. Vollering throws the bike at the line. But that is your podium. Mariana Voss on the top step of the podium, looking phenomenal in 2021, takes it from SD Works, Demi Vollering, and Movistar's Annemiek van Vluten. Amanda Spratt, Soraya Paladin, Mavi Garcia, Cecily Utrup Ludwig, Elisa Longoborghini, Ash Mulman Passio, and Cassia Nuvia Doma, your top 10. Mariana Voss back into the World Tour leader's jersey. The next stop for the riders, Flesh Wallon and Liege Baston Liege.